In terms of the in terms of the prisoners, in terms of the prisoner release, this has has hasn't actually happened yet. It's not supposed to happen until tonight. But you do think it's a good thing, yeah. Even though it's a hypothetical, same place because it hasn't happened yet. Well, it's something that they've approved. Yeah. That's in the that's in the pipeline. But that hasn't happened yet. I, I don't know where we are in the process, but yes, it's something that's been approved by the Israeli so cabinet. So you're prepared to go ahead and say it's hypothetical. Well, thing. it's not a hypothetical it's a, because it's a step that's it been, is a hypothetical it's been approved because it hasn't by the Israeli government. Yet. It hasn't happened yet. Okay, though. but it's a step that's been approved. Okay, I just want you to remember this conversation because we're going to have it over. I remember all over, of our conversations. Over, we're going to have it over a different issue, uh, maybe even later in this briefing. Not understood. Okay. It's not um, a hypothetical policy decision. It's a right. policy decision that's been made okay. and is being implemented right. as we speak. That's fine. Do you have any um, thoughts or position on whether these people who are going to be released mm -hmm. in this hypothetical release uh, are political prisoners or are they terrorists? I do not uh, have a position. Do on you that. object to the Palestinians referring to them as political prisoners? Uh, I, I don't have a position on that. I'm happy to look into it, and if I have something can to share, you, I can. I can't. Can you yes. find me because mm -hmm. this is a big uh, bone of contention. The Israel. Mm -hmm. I mean, most of these people have been convicted of of, of murder, of, of of killing people, and the Israelis are very clear on the fact that they think that these people are terrorists, even though they're releasing them. The Palestinians say that they are political prisoners, and I uh, and they have instructed their ambassadors, all their representatives around the world, to refer to them as freedom fighters, political prisoners, and I want to know if. If you don't have a position on what, uh, on what we they, call on them. what, what if, if okay. there isn't anything that you call them, do you object to the Palestinians referring to them as uh, freedom fighters? The answer is I don't know, and I will endeavor to get an answer for you on that as well. I think I would I would make the point that this was clearly a difficult step for the Israeli government to take, but that it did uh, show that they are putting some trust in the Palestinian Authority, uh, invest in the, in the PA's success, and that we do think it's a positive step. But in terms of terminology. I will look into that right. and see what I can but, do. But at the same time, mm -hmm. it, it, does it show trust in the Palestinian Authority?